Hello, good morning. My name is Dr. Zulkifli Mohammed. Currently a consultant cardiologist at CVSKL, special interest in clinical electrophysiology. We start our day with walk round roughly about 8 o'clock in the morning. I see the patients in ward, in ICU, or HDU. And then I normally come down here to the clinic and start seeing my outpatient clinic. Then you do post-procedural round. So basically, you don't have a specific time you finish. You finish when everything is finished. Sometimes it could be 7 or 8 o'clock at night. And then after that, you just go home and come back start again the next day. I was exposed to this device, which is CRTD, to treat patients with an intractable heart failure. And it makes a whole world of difference to the patient. They came in with a heart failure, they go home with the NYHA stage 3 or stage 2, and completely independence. And then I start joining National Heart Institute in, in Malaysia, and my first posting was actually in electrophysiology. Normally, it's either they have a very slow heart rate or they sometimes complain of palpitations. So as a patient walk through the door, they sometimes feeling nervous about saying electrophysiologist. A lot of them doesn't know what electrophysiologist is. I'll just start by saying where do you come from and then ask what actually brought them to see an electrician. And they will start describing what they feel and then from there on you develop possible diagnosis and then you advise patients what will be the appropriate treatment needed. I had a young patient who was having regular palpitation to the point that he is so scared to do a normal activity. And then we eventually diagnosed that he had an SVT and brought him for electrophysiology study and then completely cure the conditions. Then he goes home happy and then now he starts enjoying his life. And the fact that you can make something different to the patient, they go home happier than they were before, is really a rewarding experience. I think my biggest accomplishment so far would be that I was elected as a fellow by Heart Rhythm Society of the United States of America. And on the same year, I was elected as a president for Malaysian Heart Rhythm Society and hold the post for two years. And when I have a free time, I normally go cycling with my colleagues. The sensations of achievement when you reach the peak is indescribable. And the other thing that I enjoy doing in my free time is this golfing. The fun of hitting the ball long or putting the, the ball into the hole is, is a great achievement. And so far in, in, in my career of playing golf, I have got hole in one twice. For well, those who want to pursue a career in electrophysiology, you have to spend an extra couple of years after your basic cardiology training to get specialized training in electrophysiology. And it's going to be a lot of hurdles along the way. The medical school is just the beginning of it. Never give up, stick to your plan and pursue what you like. <laughs>